why is it that we struggle so much with the vitamin D and, and what is the best way to, uh, um, to, to address that? Yeah, it's because of the pigment in our skin, the melanin in our skin. So we don't absorb like the sun the mm. way like Caucasian ah, people okay. do. Mm. So that, that's what it is. It's like it, it's, uh, it also helps us as we age. We know that as well. But it, it, all, it, it prevents us from absorbing the sun. So we don't, you know, people walking around every day, other races walk around every day, they're getting their, you know, their vitamin D is coming in through the skin. It can permeate their skin. But because of the pigment and the melanin in our skin, it's very hard for us to absorb it. Which is why that when you go to the doctor, just like you said, my mom who's 90, same thing with her. My girlfriend calling, she's like, oh my God, my vitamin, everyone's vitamin D is low because they don't even know this. Mm -hmm. So that's the reason why. And that's why I kind of wanted to focus the supplement brand and have it infused with high levels of vitamin D mm. that would, you know, fit the needs of black women as we're taking their protein shakes. You know, when I looked at, when I did the research and I wouldn't looked at the stores, the vitamin store, GNC or what have you, and I looked at all the different brands out there, they barely have any vitamin D in them at all. They're not wow. addressing that because, mm -hmm. you know, they're not even thinking it's about it. It's not important. Right. important to them. It's right. mainstream. Right, right, right. Okay. So. It's not. Ooh. Um, yeah. But vitamin D. It affects your mood. It's, it yes. affects so many things. And if you ever have anyone who's like um, taking vitamin D afterwards, they realize like they kind of like raise up a little bit. Yeah, like so I didn't know so it affects yeah, your mood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You remember when COVID was out, they were telling people like vitamin, they increase your vitamin, vitamin, D. vitamin D as well. Yeah. 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 yeah it's, it, uh, it's it can cause depression. Yep. You don't have enough. Yep. Like, oh, okay. You don't have enough. Um, I know for me, yes. my joints start to ache really yes. bad. Yes. If I don't, and I haven't been. I go. To, I get my physical tomorrow. She took me off of it because my levels were steady where they were supposed to be, and I'm curious to see how they are now because I haven't taken any in a, in a year. Oh, they're so, probably going back down. Yeah, I'm I don't even know why they would take you off. I don't know. I mean, what, what's going to happen all of a sudden? <laughs> And she does that. Yeah. She does that period. I've been going to the same doctor for, I don't know, 20 years. 20, 20 years. Oh. And off and on, she'll take me off and she'll put me back on. So I don't know, but I'm going to tell her this time, don't take me off. Yeah, it's not going to go away. Yeah. That, that issue's not going to go right. away for us. We have to have those levels of vitamin D. Yeah. Maybe I need to get mine because I was supposed to take it years ago. And I need to get it. But you know what? Everyone I had to ask the doctor <laughs> to give the kids the, the blood test for the vitamin D deficiency. And when I did, they were both deficient. And I'm like, why don't they ask? Why don't they have them take this? So, so most parents uh, should probably not, ask for it. For yeah, it. I mean, but that's, that's not part of their blood test with no, their blood work? No. Mm -hmm. When they're not specifically, I looked oh, wow. for no. it and it wasn't there. Oh, okay. So okay. I, I took them back and she went and she had me take them to the lab to take it and they were both deficient. It's also why too, I don't know if your doctor is, is black or, or not. My, mine is. Well, okay. Yeah, they are. A lot of, a lot of people aren't going to get that advice from doctors who aren't African American as well. Mm -hmm. Because it's just not on their radar. You know, you know it's doctors, it's a business too. Medical is mm -hmm. a business too. First mm -hmm. of all, we need to educate ourselves. But also having a doctor who understands the issues that we have as a race is very important. You can watch the full episode or subscribe to our YouTube channel at www.bs4entrepreneurs.com.